What do you guys consider as cheating? <laughs> so when you don't know the answer in an exam and you take out a... <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Hi. How are you guys doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Your name? Eugenia. Okay. Alejandra. Alejandra. All right. So my question is, what do you guys consider as cheating? I think that cheating can be both uh, physical and emotional. Okay. Yes, uh, you can cheat with someone physically, no, with, I don't know, some kind of interaction. And it can also be emotional because when you're with someone but you're thinking about another person. Another person. Oh, okay. Yes, and you have another person on your mind. You so smart. You know everything. Or you're talking with another person or you're hanging out with another person without being physical interaction, but it's emotional interaction, like an emotional attachment with another person. That's cheating too? Yes. But okay. Yeah. I mean, okay. What about uh -huh. you? For me, cheating it's if I have like talking uh, like some exclusivity with someone if okay. you talk about that and you do something against that okay. that's cheating that's like cheating. i don't think cheating uh, thinking in other person i don't think that as cheating okay. because i think we are humans and we always ah, see. Yes. cheating yeah, with right. ourselves with other people with but what you want. with what you want we yeah. are always cheating us also because you are thinking like any possibilities i yeah, think it's true. it's a human thing. because like in, in also like in what you're doing no like uh, you're in a work but you really what your dream is to be a painter uh -huh, and you're uh -huh. not doing that because i don't know economic possibilities or whatever but you're cheating with yourself uh -huh. i think you're you're right that is not that's not cheating but i think emotional attachment okay you know like if you like another girl or yeah, another boy yeah, yeah. And yeah, you are with another boy. Yeah, obviously. obviously. Okay. Uh -huh. Yeah, no, yeah, no obviously that's cheating. cheating yeah. Too, okay. yeah, if you have that like exclusivity conversation. Yes. Like, uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. I think that's true. Yes. Yeah, this topic is so confusing because most people think that cheating is just like physically. Ah, uh, no. No, mm. no. That's a thing. No, I just, I don't I think. think. No, I think it's worse to be emotionally mm -hmm. attached okay. with another yeah. Yes, I think that's I, I worse. And I think physical, uh, it can. You can always make mistakes. Yeah. I, I really do. I am a believer of that. Is yeah, that, I think so too. Because like, we are humans. We are humans. Exactly. And kind of like animals. the sexual desire. Uh -huh. You can always have sexual desires with another person. Or with mm -hmm. another. Yeah. Yes. Uh, whatever. But. Is the, I, I think emotional it does have a. You know a big. It's a big piece in the cheating thing part. Yeah, I think it's most. I think that I would be able to to forgive a physical cheating okay. more than an emotional yeah, cheating. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, me too. Me too. It oh. would be easier for yeah, me. <laughs> All right. Hello. Hi. How are you guys doing? Good. Good. How are you? I'm good. Your name? I'm Amy. Okay. Kim. Kim. All right. All right. So my question is, what do you guys consider as cheating? Um, I think putting any form of feelings, whether that's just mentally or physically into anyone else that's not your partner is going to count as cheating to me. So texting, even if there's nothing physical going on, if there is some form of emotional attachment to it is going to count as cheating for oh. me. Okay. Yeah. If you're going out of your way to text somebody and it's not just in a friendly manner, it's going to count as oh. cheating. You smart. I never knew that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what about you? If you're going out of your way to talk to someone that you're not with, I would also consider that cheating. That's cheating. <laughs> yeah, a lot of people think it's just physical, but exactly, it's exactly. most of the time it's emotional. Whoa. Yeah, so I think yeah. if you're hiding it from your partner in any way, then it's gonna count as yeah. cheating to me, at least. Yeah, yeah. that makes that makes sense. Yeah. That yeah. Makes sense. All right. Hi. Hi. Hello. Your name? Patricia. Okay. Blanca. Blanca. We're sisters. Sisters. Oh, that's nice. Right. So I have this question for you guys. So the question is, what do you guys consider as cheating? Hello? So when you don't know the answer in an exam. <laughs> and you take out a... <laughs> 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 I mean, she, okay. We know, we know. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead. So it depends. Mm -hmm. uh, a little kiss, we have all done it, and you can, we can forgive it. You can speak in Spanish. Yeah. Yeah. Or, yeah. Eh, pues un besito a la cualquiera se le escapa, pero. <laughs> okay. A mí no se me escapa tanto, eh. <laughs> no. 
eh, si es algo así más serio y también es que prefiero que se dé un beso en una discoteca que esté escribiendo mucho tiempo con una chica. Okay. Eso lo veo más de, eh, engañar. Es, es, es sneaky text. The sneaky text is worse than just a little kiss in a club, I think. Okay. Okay. But yeah, when it's sex, that's, uh, that's complete okay. cheating. And also the little text, I also find it cheating. Entendi tudo, entendi. Porque eu tô falando português. Ah. Sim, aprendi português muito tempo. Ah, muy sim, bien. Sim, sim. 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 What do you consider as cheating? Uh, when you're with someone, like in a relationship, and you go with someone else and kiss or like flirt with someone else without telling them, without their consent. So yeah, I think that's so, it. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Hi. 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 Your name? Bree. Okay. Monica. Monica, all right. So my question to you guys is, what do you guys consider as cheating? Um, anything where you have to keep it from your partner, whether it's emotional, physical, like, I consider that cheating. Yeah, baby! Oh, okay. Yeah. That makes sense. What about you? Um, I guess same thing, but I mean, when it comes to, uh, like, Instagram, like, if they're flirting with other people, <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah, like, okay. things like that, like, if they have to hide it from you, if they can't show you. Oh, you're cheating, right? Yeah. Of course. Oh, I never knew that. Oh. If you're not 100% faithful. Anything shady yeah. falls under the umbrella of cheating. Like if you can't show me, oh, okay. then you're guilty. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay, so like you're having a partner and then like you're kind of doing something behind that person back is cheating. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah. And on some sort of level it's cheating. Like what you're okay with like is up to you, but yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Your name? Francesca. Okay. All right, so I have this question for you, okay? The question is, what do you consider as cheating? I think it's a very wide question. Okay. I, I think know. everything regarding not being honest and uh, not having the best intention in mind. Okay. Um, yeah, and really trying to fool someone. Yeah, baby! I think you can put that in different contexts. I oh, think okay. there's, it's it's a good thing to be kind and fair with yeah, all that's relationships. Right. That's right. That's right. So basically, like most people think cheating is just like kind of physically. No, yeah. I think, um, well, I mean, you can cheat in friendships. You can cheat in every type of relationship, I think. Um, and I think um, physical is one part of it, but I think you can cheat emotionally, emotionally and okay. in your thoughts as well. So, um, being fair and being kind and being honest with okay, yourself okay. and then being honest with other people, I think. Pretty sure. <laughs> yes. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> yeah. Bye. Good. Okay, bye.